Well, here's the second floor. Yeah, well, I really have to say it's it's much nicer to run through and try to cover this when I'm not on the lowdown. It's by Robert Grossvenor. Titled Unknown, titled 2009. Well, one of the benefits of having fewer artists is that some of these people get a chance to really stretch out. You get a whole gallery or a, an installation like this that takes up 2,000 square feet, maybe. by Julia Fish. Maybe some experimental photographs by Josh Brand. Some little oils on panel by Marine Gallus. Kind of make me think of uh, Alex Katz or maybe Fairfield Porter. photographs by Nina Bergman and they document the story of former Marine Ty Eagle Jessica Jackson Hutchins. Okay, so she's got a bunch of President Obama clippings taped on the couch, stuck on the couch, and some ceramics on the front there. I wonder if those are supposed to be couch potatoes. Here's a piece by our old friend Don Clemens. Yeah. Maybe one of the better known of the Williamsburg meta drawing artists. This is Mrs. Yeah. Jessica Drummond. Kind of makes me think of a Ed Kainholtz. Mm 
And it's by Hannah Greeley, titled Duel. by Jim Lutz. It's by Ari Markopoulos. Detroit. installation by Mark Cursells. I guess these are each individual pieces here. And they've got this in the, the lobby gallery here. Well, I, I appreciate the kind of way this is mixed between architecture, furniture design, sculpture an installation yeah vermilion black and white it's a nice color scheme this is by Daniel McDonald crossing the river Hades this is Michael Jackson Beetlejuice. Oh, I like the vapor rising out of the river sticks. And I don't know whether the sculptural garden is open either, but it's kind of drizzly out there, so maybe we'll pass. Oh, it says this piece was designed by, designed by Theaster Gates Cosmology Yard. Do you have to go out there? Thank you. This lady has very generously offered to open the magic door for me. So we've got our thousands of these little like pallets, little wooden units. Thousands sounds like Tibetan chanting. It's kind of rainy out here, but the uh, the rainwater on the wood makes it smell good. I think we're going to wrap it up here for the 2010 Whitney Biennial and remind you if you uh, have any thoughts or criticisms you like to share, you can post them on the website. So thank you for watching. It's James Calm signing off. Hey, thanks, Kate. Rabbit run.